All right, what is up, guys? I'm Dex here, and welcome back to another Minecraft Java edition video. So today's video is about hidden blocks and items you can get with commands in Minecraft Java edition. And I don't know why my skin is Alex, but yeah, let's get on to this thing. So first of all, we got air blocks, set block, bam, 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 and air. Like literally, everybody knows what air block is, cause it's because it is everywhere. However, in Java edition, there's a thing called void air and also cave air. Bam. So yeah, these things actually do place on the ground because uh, if you were to place on a cave air right here and then if I were to do it again, then it says cannot place a block because there's cave air right here. So yeah, these things actually do place down for some reason. It's pretty cool. So. The next one is command blocks. Like everybody knows command blocks, but since you cannot get command blocks in the inventory, I'm gonna be showing you guys a command. Give fp command block. There we go. And you guys will be able to mess with the commands in Minecraft Pocket Edition. I mean, not Pocket Edition, it's Java Edition. <laughs> and also, there's give fp command block minecart. Alright? Like, nobody really uses this block, but it is there. It is still there. So, yeah. I'm gonna be doing say hi, 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 which I failed miserably. Done. And then, I'm gonna be activating it. And this thing will activate just like this. Minecart with command block. Alright? So, the next one is going to be the jigsaw block. Give a P jigsaw. Alright? So, this block is used for generations of villages and like um, like structures basically like mansions i believe but mostly for villages so this pool target pool name target name turns into join type rollable aligned levels keep jigsaws on or off generate like done cancel There's so many options for my non big brain all right so the next one we're gonna be looking at is the structure blocks so give fp structure block and with this comes the void block so i'm gonna be placing down a structure block right here and then and then i'll go ahead and turn into save mod and then i'll name this structure tests 555 five, five, and then save it and i'll make like a tnt structure and then i will save it again and then i will load it right here so structure blocks are basically slash clone command but more visible basically so load 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 there we go so yeah this thing will load so basically so you basically copy this and paste it right here so for the structure void, if I try to place it down, there's nothing. You cannot see anything and you can just walk straight through it, just like this, all right? However, if you were to place it down inside the structure blocks uh, square, and if you were to turn on show invisible blocks, then you'll be able to see the structure void block, like where the structure block voids are. So these blue squares are air blocks and these red squares are the structure void blocks all right just like this bam bam and let's just explode these tnts just for fun you know let's just do it oh my god oh my god oh so these structure voids are explodable so they do die from explosion all right, the next block is going to be the barrier blocks. And the barrier block is basically the bedrock, but it's invisible. So give a P block. And once you place it down, you will be able to see it if you're in creative mode and you're holding the barrier block item. So it will disappear. And then once you hold it, it will appear again, just like this. The next blocks we're going to be looking at are the potion blocks, not potion blocks. The potion items so give fp potion and splash potion splash potion and also there's a lingering potion and give fp tipped arrow so 
these potions are called uncraftable potion, or splash uncraftable potion, lingering uncraftable potion, and uncraftable tipped arrow. It says no effects, no effects, no effects, and no effects. So let's see, let's test out if it really has no effects. So I'm gonna be turning myself into survival, and I will try to drink this, you know? And bam, nothing, literally nothing. No status effect, nothing. Nada, zero. Summon zombie. I don't know why the sky turned dark, but thankfully it turned dark, so the zombie's not gonna be dying. So I'm gonna be trying to, you know, use this splash potion to both of us. And nothing, literally nothing happened. And lingering potion, let's try to use it like right here and nothing no effect whatsoever all right and uncraftable tipped arrow give a p bow and then let's try to shoot at the zombie and let's see what it does to the zombie nothing those are some interesting potions and tipped arrows right so now let's look at the next block and the next item so that is give a p enchanted book all right so it looks like a normal enchanted book However, game mode creative, if I were to do, if I were to look at it, then there's no enchantments whatsoever. So enchantment, so these are normal enchantment books. So there's protection, projectile protection, uh, soul speed, smite, sharpness, and like soul speed 3, respiration, but this one does not have anything. It's just a plain old enchantment book that has no enchantment. So what happens if you were to apply this enchant to an armor, like a weapon, you know? Okay, I'm gonna be trying to enchant the crossbow and nothing. Helmet, nothing. Sword, nothing. Boot, nothing. Bow, nothing. Trident, nothing. And shield, nothing. And even the anvil, nothing. So the next hidden item is gonna be another book, basically, but it's a written book. So give a P, written book, and if I were to open this, then it says invalid book tag because the book has nothing in it. So I think that is why it says invalid book tag. So yeah, and the next one I get looking at is another book, and this thing is called give a P knowledge book. So this thing, this book is basically give a P crafting table. In the crafting table, there's this book right here. It's a recipe book. It's basically the same item, but it's in the inventory, I mean, item form. Yeah. And it has nothing. It has literally no use except, except knowing the recipes. So to do that, you're going to be doing give a P and then you're gonna be typing minecraft.apple, you know? Let's go Apple. And if I were to click this book, like right click it, then it will say nothing. Wait, 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 wait. Give a P and then I'm gonna be trying stone. There we go. And then I'll try to use it. And there we go. So new recipes unlock, check your recipe book. Check, check your recipe book. So I just unlocked the recipe for the stone. Let's try redstone and same thing will happen. There we go, just like this. So next block is gonna be the furnace. Furnace and then lit is equal to true. And you will get a furnace that is always lit even though there's nothing inside the furnace. The next item is the debug stick. Debug stick. Stick, stick. I like to call it stick. It's way easier for me. The debug stick is used for manipulating the game's. Wait, why? Why is this not? Okay, this word is broken. This debug stick. And if I were to use a debug stick on like right here, then it will turn the grass, or like any blocks basically, into like. Like it will cycle through the data of the blocks, you know, just like this. So you can flip this thing just like this. So it grows from the top. What? How is it even possible? Oh my God, why? No, it is so illegal. Oh my God, no. Let's see if we can also do it on water. 
No, it does not work in water. New recipes unlocked. Oh my god, I just entered water and just unlocked a new recipe. So, whenever you touch water for the first time in your life, you just magically know how to make a boat. Wow. Alright, so the next one we're gonna be looking at is a portal and end the portal and also the end gateway. So, nether portal. So, in Minecraft Pocket Edition, it is just portal, not nether portal. So, in Java Edition, it's nether portal and it looks like this. And there's also end portal. End portal, just like this. It's only visible for the top. And lastly, there's also the end gate way just like this right and you can enter this thing just like this achievement made a remote gateway oh my god that is so amazing all right now let's look at the 1.17 exclusive features powder snow bucket so if i were to place on a powder bucket right here and then it will get the powder snow just like this and if i were to scoop it away then yeah nothing will be left in the bucket so there's only two states there's snow or no snow snow or no snow but there's the hidden stage in between these two states cauldron powder snow cauldron just like this and level two one or two two just like this but this is only half full compared to that one and it's impossible to get to this state game mode survival so let's see what happens if i were to take the snow from this one so i cannot even take the snow from this one but this one it will work just like this wow that is so interesting oh my god the next thing we're gonna be looking at is the lightning rod powered so if you didn't know the lightning rod image resin signal only if it is hit by the lightning so summon lightning bolt and it will emit the lightning bolt i mean emit the resonance signal for like a second however there is a lightning rod that emits the resonance signal like constantly rod and then powered is equal to true and if you're to place on resonance then it will emit resonance signal no matter what even though there's no lightning however 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 if the lightning strikes this thing then it will update and it will turn off just like this all right, so the last one we're looking at is the Amethyst Jettis Crystal or whatever that is called. So if I were to place on these plugs, then they always emit light, just like this. However, there's also a variant that does not emit light. So set block, then lit is equal to false. So this is an unlit Amethyst Cluster. So there's a normal one and this is the weird one. But this thing does not emit any light. Lastly, if you don't know more about this hidden blocks but in better edition, then check out this video. So that's it for today's video guys. Thank you for watching and see you guys in the next video.